together.
Watch your posture. Keep those boots tucked in.
battle. Corona Plan. Pokemon. Team Battle. Club Corona Plan.
あると思う
Let's fucking go. What's up? Hello, hello. We're turning up the monitor. Okay. What's up, boys? What's up? Okay, perfect. Well, nobody's gonna want to play because everyone's gonna be wanting to watch this. Okay. Nick Hugo versus Apple. We are here, boys. We got the Thug Finals tiebreaker. We have upwards of $20 floating around on this set here. <laughs> Tiebreaker extraordinaire. We're going to have some, you can see the crowd in the background. This is going to be absolute insanity. Nick Hugo versus Apple, the only tiebreaker Tri-City has ever had. Really? Tiebreaker extraordinaire. Both of these boys out here, um, Apple and Nick Hugo. So what is it, We Fit versus Sonic? I think who Apple- has Apple been playing lately? Apple has, I don't know who they play. I think they, uh, last I checked it was Game Watch. Not 100% sure, but if it is Game & Watch, Sun Salutation will be gobbled right up by that bucket. And on top of that, reflected on oh, the soccer ball. Yeah. And on top of that, Apple is Joy-Con Squad. Let's go. Joy-Cons out here. We are talking straight OG. This. We're, yeah, look at it. Turn around. Look at that. Everyone no wants one, to watch no this. One wants to play. <laughs> all right, tiebreaker extraordinaire. We got side bets all over the place Whoa. on this match. So it is going to be Cloud. Cloud versus We Fit. Now, I think We Fit is definitely an underdog high tier. And I think Cloud is kind of like people are starting to agree that he's high tier. Yeah. So here we go. Three stock, Whoa. thug final, seven go. minutes. Let's see how this goes. Right out of the bat. Oh my god, throwing out the F smash. All right, let's see if we get a berry set up. No up air. Good drift by Apple to get back in. So it's pretty slow here. Both players trying to display the jewel. Perry almost into it. Up smash. Apple almost going insane there. And falling into the down air. Rolling away or down tilting away from that. Let's see. Oh, my God. These stairs. Oh, and he's already almost got limit. So All right, so yeah, we got limit now. We'll see. Is he gonna save it? Is he gonna use it? Oh, he got it. Gets over the soccer ball. Gets a dash touch. Oh, it did get knocked out. I think he tried to use it. Yeah. yeah he used it and got hit by. Nick. Tried to catch that landing on the platform, getting under the soccer ball with the fair. All right, so we got an offstage situation here. No edge guard from Nick Yuga, but yeah, I thought this was gonna be scary. All right, so we've got a little bit of recovery. Oh, and then the forward smash. Okay. All right, so we're going to have to see how this goes. Nick healing up a little bit. Also racking up the damage. I Did he get a heavy breathing, heat breathing in? I couldn't tell. I don't think he did. All right. He, oh, there it is. Okay, the up B. So now we have the DD, but he is going to get back here. Yes, he with the edge guard. Going to try to catch that roll. Get up another... I've never seen it before out of Apple, but I Ooh, is that gonna kill? It does oh, kill! Side regular. B! Regular <laughs> neutral B, or side B takes yeah, it. Apple gonna take that one. They change that in this game. Let's see, is he gonna rack him? Oh, he barely air dodges. I think that would have been like 
Yeah, whole bunch. Okay. Oh, Apple waiting. Oh, doesn't even punish it. It clanks. <laughs> 119 <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's that X smash for so much so percent. Catches that roll. Apple, barely, barely looking for this. We're gonna have to see if. All right, we got the limit. Oh, the side B gets knocked yeah, out of it. He just gets sun salutation out of it. All right. Oh, forward smash. No punish on the F smash. And it looks like Apple's gonna recover for free. Nice air dodge. How's he gonna get back? Oh, what? Oh, how? How do you? Oh, and then the F smash. Apple takes it. Apple, some people are going to be making some big money off this game, so everyone's getting hype. We're going to have to see what happens here. Ooh, some jabs down, going down. down. Another F smash is shielded. They dash attack out of shield. All right, things slowing down a little bit here. F smash coming through. Just Soccer ball. Right he doesn't want to approach it. He doesn't know when a forward smash is going to come out. Absolutely right, sir. So both these players, uh, I think, Nick Pika is trying his best. Oh, there's the dare spike. Yeah, he gets hit by head and ball. Oh, the side beat takes it. Good landing okay, catch. This is definitely doable for Cloud. Yeah. Well Another edge guard situation. Oh my god, he dares right into it. Oh, the back air floating above. Oh, air dodge through it. Doesn't tech though. Is there a tech chase? No, counter tech chase with that dash tag. Oh, oh gets he gets the, another one. Yeah, gets the All right, off stage. Back. How's he going to do it? The Sun Salutation. He's no. dead. Nick Huga taking game number one. We're going to get a counter pick from Apple. Uh, Nick Huga's going to ban three stages. We'll see what they are. They are. Battlefield, Smashville, and Lila are and the bans. Will Nick we Huga. see a cloud out of Apple game two? Uh, I'm not sure. Will he he, got, he got some stuff. Definitely worked it out, but I think Apple does have a lot of characters. Um, we'll have to see yeah, what Apple comes up after this. Character, character. But we'll see if he... We'll see if he decides. Stop the battle! Refit Trader! We got the refit again yeah. from Grand Master Grip. Potential character change from Apple. We got some thunking. We do have the stage pick. It is stage first. So, we'll see the stage. And we'll see the counter pick. No, oh, that's okay. We're going to have to see. Thinking long and hard about how we're going to kind of pick here. Totally acceptable. Yeah, what, well, what feasibly, like, theoretically, what could work around I've the seen, that has? Um, I've seen so many characters from Apple, and I think, I think it's more about personal preference, really. I think that if you feel comfortable with the character and you feel like you can get around the weak fits, her aerials, yeah. her, her projectiles, and then get in and win this one again. And oh. I think Roy is going to be the one to do that. Yeah. So actually, yeah. one of the biggest advocates for Apple is a Roy main. So I think we've got some hype on the Apple side. One, go. Of our and we're on FD as well. So melee Roy main says heck yeah. So we're going to see, ooh, throwing out up smashes. You know, Grandmaster does like to jump over Apple a lot here. So I think that's good presence of mind from Apple. Oh, swatting the ball away into an F smash. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, is he just charging it? Hello? What is neutral? Who cares about neutral? Oh my god, that almost snapped on the two frame. He almost got a jab at reset. That would have been insane. That would have been like, oh my god, the fattest counter. The fattest counter I've ever seen from Apple. Bringing out the Roy here. Oh my god. He's got a lot of money. The whole crowd's popping off. Grandmaster Grip trying to take out his first stock. Deep breathing. Okay. Getting some percent off. Oh, the Sun Salutation doesn't go, but he goes for the F Smash. Punishes F Smash with F Smash. Right, the Joy Con squad is coming alive here. Racking up percent against Nick Huga. Oh, yeah. back here. Edge guard opportunity for Nick Huga. More deep breathing, more healing. Uh, yeah. Jumps over the Sun Salutation. It looks like Nick Cooper is having a hard time backing through this. Oh, Dash Deck with Deep Breathing. Still not doing it, but the counter. Counter doesn't do it. He doesn't die, though. Recover comes through. Slides up the stage. Yeah, I didn't think he was going back. Apple with so much percent. 150. Still racking it up. A few. Oh, this is that dash grab. So Nick taking it there. Oh, the up smash on the shield doesn't work. Out of parry. Yeah. Yeah. Did, um, I think. 
we've been trainers um, forward smash shifted the hurt box back right. before she went oh forward. Oh my god. So Another oh. F smash! The so tipper so hilt hitbox on the F Boom. smash. Get out of here. Definitely do We've got doable chance in the background. See. Oh, a counter! Waits for the counter with that sick floating back air. That's the FGC yeah. fundamentals. We are talking fighting game community with trainer here against Joy-Con Squad Roy. Oh my god, the ball DSS. He turns oh, it around! He gets so much percent! Are you kidding me? DQ that eats it! Alright, we've got more swatting. The Roy, he turns it around again, but this time. It doesn't work. He air dodges through it, but gets the jab. What's he gonna do? F smash, he takes it. We are down to one stock for both players. This is entirely doable from the Akuda. But the side view is gonna wreck up a bunch of damage there. All right, a little bit of damage. Oh, the parry again, but jumps out. Wow. Apple is I've never on seen so much parry, yeah. yeah. Apple is on point. Oh, the F tilt jab? Oh, no jab reset. <laughs> All right, Edgar, Edgar. Uchel B coming in. He turns it around and hits him. Doesn't kill, though. Lots of percent, but it does trade. Up tilt. That oh, punishing down. that. Okay. okay. Oh, he's oh so God. far. Yeah, no jump really off stage. Cool. What are we going to see from both of these players? Oh, tries to call out the jump, but drifts back. Oh, the F smash. All right, the sun salutation coming through. Oh, gets that down tilt. No dash tech. Punish. Oh, my God, no punish. Dash attack. That was almost it. Doesn't air dodge this time. Does it? Does he get a oh, go? Yeah. It misses. Yeah. Nick Hugo yeah. with the fully charged F smash takes it out. Everyone gonna take their money. Nick Hugo wins 2-0. Oh, thank Incredible. you so much. Incredible Great sportsmanship show. from both Incredible players. Incredible show out of the both of them. All right. Seth. Seth, five dollars. Incredible show out of both competitors today. LDS, four dollars. Apple, Apple just barely. Barely misspacing that get up attack. Or Nick Huga micro spacing his charge forward smash, expecting you to get You both up. put in three, that so you get six. Yeah, definitely, that's okay. definitely for me. big brain plays out. All right, there. we're going to get the tournament back on track here. So give us a moment and we'll get your next sets. Thank you for watching. All right. Okay. Come in. Placed up for the rest of the day. It's gonna be hard to match that energy. JD. It's uh, this is actually this is an an insane matchup we have. This is probably the first time they played, right? Yeah, this is definitely the first time they played. Jantham and Lux are two newcomers, totally new to the scene. I don't think. I mean, Jantham. I don't know when he started coming, but like before Ultimate, never heard of these guys. And uh, the reason they stick out so much is how well they've been doing since they got introduced. Um, I think Lux got ninth last week, and uh, he's definitely capable to get top eight like, consistently. And Jantham has been getting top eight consistently. And 
He got ninth. Oh no, he got he got seventh. We had an argument. We had an argument. Yep. Okay, he got seventh. So both of these guys have only gotten top eight so far since they came here, and there are two. There are our two premier newcomers for Tri City. This is super hype for our for our scene for the growth of our scene. Two new guys from Ultimate that we have and we, everyone at the scene has have taken a loving to these guys because a lot of people here just they, yeah a lot of people here don't they, they don't they play lame characters they complain about the game and they don't get any better <laughs> and so this is a really nice change of pace and I'm so excited for this match where they actually play against each other it should be K Rule versus Incineroar if I'm not mistaken I think Lux plays someone else also but I don't know remember who who's he playing Oh, oh, I just mean, said, yeah. Heavy is Incineroar is, yeah, he's he's barely a heavy, but he's a heavy. Um, no, he's not. <laughs> what? <laughs> what counts as a super heavy? Like, he's not DDD Bowser or Donkey Kong, right? But he's super popular. Yeah, he's a big man, but... I'm sure most big characters are... There you go. Okay. Oh, Jesus. that's... Okay, that's a little heavy. Oh, that's a fat cat. Oh, yeah. No, <laughs> I didn't, but... Okay. Game starting. Finally, get to see this. Three, two, one, this is like a foul. UK rule. This is go. one of the UK rules I've ever made time to watch. It's really cool. It's really cool. That's, a, that's one good thing about UK rules. Uh, a character like him, slow and big, you wouldn't think would have such a good projectile game. But that crown's actually really hard to counter counterplay. In fact, a boomerang, too. That was a really good presence. Okay, wait a second. That did 34%. I just had to point that out. That was a revenge back throw. It wasn't for revenge. He revenged a crown, and he did back throw, and it did 36%. Um, was, yeah, well, everything you see is crazy big damage. Oh, the crown and the down smash. Is that a setup? I've never seen that. I can get hit by that. That's nuts. Man, that's nuts. That makes a huge difference. The two heavy characters like this, they're both they're both really susceptible to dying because they both hit really hard. So the first one to die is a huge disadvantage. And uh yeah, if Lux can find a way to just keep Incineroar out, which it seems like he knows exactly how to do, then uh Yeah, if he's within range of Oh he did that drop through stuff? Ooh, wow. wow. I don't think he's ready for that. It didn't look like he died very well. Taking a second to think about it. Okay. Now he got he got that grab and he missed the timing. Did it too early or too late. That's kinda sad. There's a different timing for every character with that side piece. Back on stage. This is hard. Phantom. I mean all he needs is like kill him and get revenge and then get revenge again. <laughs> so I'm, it's still doable, but god it looks like Lux has his number. It doesn't look like Anthem's probably ever played a good game. <laughs> Not too, like, insulting, but I actually am willing to bet. Oh, hey, Red. Yeah, he, he, when he first showed up, the first time I ever saw him, apparently Jacob already knew about him, but the first time I ever saw him was at a Sunday yeah. event, and that, oh, man. Not a move you see a lot from K. Rule. Lux kind of had all the options. He went through the whole team set. Taking out Jantham with style right there. That was sick. Didn't see the counter once though. Okay, well, uh, Lux making really short work of Jantham. Not, not as close as the game as I was working it out to be. <laughs> well, let's see how game two goes. What? Maybe. It, I, I'm, I'm. It, it might be a matchup thing, but I'm willing to bet uh, Jantham might have just never played a game rule. Because I've played maybe one or two, and I've played like a million games. So. There's not very many online. For that. I, mean, I don't play Elite Smash. Good. Once you get to the Elite Smash, K rules are gone. <laughs> yeah, that uh, that crown sprint. Yep. Yeah, oh, yeah. oh my goodness. With the okay. okay. Um, I haven't heard about this, but I mean, I've only seen him play once or twice, and I know he's someone who's always he's always working. He's always playing. He doesn't play, he's not a one trick pony, he doesn't plan on sticking to one character forever like that. So, so far it's, no, it's even, that's all I know. Yeah. I, I think he tried to power shield that crowd. It looks like he does not understand it. 
How is DK gonna get in through these uh, projectiles? That was the projectiles. The fact that can uh, step up in front of any enemy after the projectile. Yup. Okay. Misspaced that bear and uh, got hit by the front afterwards. Come on, come on. Yep, I, I can definitely tell he doesn't, he hasn't played against this before. He doesn't know about the fall through thing. You can fall through and drift forward a little bit when you're doing that. And that's the only way you can move. That is the only thing you can move to do before stopping. That's the suck. Forward air, not going to reach, but he spaced it enough. Um, that down tilt, not going to trip at that high of a percent, so let's just, he knew what he was going to Got to get there somehow. Oh my god, Jansen has no clue. I mean, it is hard. You have to really think about it. But he has not gotten successfully gotten through these projectiles once. Kind of eliminating the crown. Oh, there he goes. Crown into forward air. Uh, Lux not ready for him to follow up so quickly. I think he could have avoided it if he, was, if he knew what he was going for. But he jump in. Holy shit. He wow. just down air up air. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Probably is a normal thing in the K rule world. I've never seen that. Okay. Up, up air juggles. K rule being one of the more juggable characters. Just like DK, huge, huge character. Running away from the projectile. Hopefully, he like, like, comes up with something. Forward air looks like it auto pickles too. It's hard. It's hard for a character like DK. Big body. There, okay. there we go. He rolled behind it. Oh, oh. what the fuck? Let's pause or something. Come on. Someone pause. Oh. So close. Okay. Yeah, that was close. He needed that. He needs this kill pretty soon. Ooh, that forward smash. It was a, a decent idea with him using a lot of aerials, but he didn't time it perfectly. I just want to see him. I'm not biased or anything. I just want to see him get close. <laughs> yeah. Always yeah I'd want to see a close game. So. Close games are the most. Oh, he grabbed him on a downstairs. Go, 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 go. That we killed. Come on, come on, come on. Forward throw actually sends less. Oh, oh the, there it hit is. The, hit it the eye. What, what is the opposite of an apex? Is it like a crescent? He'll hit it the crescent of, a, of the forward air. I don't know if that's the right word. Like, I remember learning about sound waves. <laughs> oh shit, you can't roll through that. That is strong! Ooh. Oh my god! He That's died at like game. 130 from that. It wasn't even at the leg. <laughs> wow, he brought it back. Uh, he was doing pretty good with the Donkey Kong. Definitely way better than, than Incineroar. And, no, Lux, Lux will get that out of here. Definitely not gonna beat me with the second air. That's rough. K rules a hard matchup yeah. for a lot of uh, characters that I've seen. Yeah, well, it's uh, yeah. He's not a very common character, and if you aren't super fast, K rule can give you a run for your money. Sure. And now, who do we got next, Jacob? Hey. Zach and who? Zach and oh. Jacob. All right, Zach and Oniro not. Uh, Zach's tag is just Zach. Oniro not is Jacob. He's the TO of the tournament, runner of the stream, and my roommate. <laughs> um. I think this is Jacob. I'm pretty sure a seated win, but this will be a Palutena ditto. One of three Palutenas here in this tournament, and Let's see how it goes. One of the the other third one being me. So this should be interesting. I think they've played before, and Jacob won. I don't know how many times, but I don't think Jacob's lost to him yet. Or, oh, nine or nine. Be a lot of. <laughs> As, uh, says Palutena. There it goes. Pretty much all of the movement that we just like. Okay, here. <laughs> Do a map we're going to be playing on today. Uh, yeah. I, there, uh, there's a good chance they'll strike the PS2. I think Jacob's on board with that. I don't know. It just depends on Zach. Uh, I saw a lot of uh, Pokemon Stadium 2 today. So I'm not it's the most popular stage. It's definitely the most popular stage in the game uh, for tournaments so far. Stop the battle! Oh shit, Rex on Roy, what the fuck? Oh my god! Oh no, no, when D Donkey Kong. Kinda mad. Oh, <laughs> I really am invested in watching the Nairo Nacho go as my roommate One. plays the same character. Oh, yeah, yeah. Up against the DK. Yeah, just messing around. He, if, I, mean, I don't know if he's technically secondary to DK in the match now, because we haven't talked about it. I know, I heard him say that DK is like his most character now, but I know that he specifically is a DK to troll people in the, in the public lobby, in like public arenas online. And I don't know if he's ever going to bring it down. Well, it looks like he's just shitting on him. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, he destroyed Zag in that first attack anyway, so whatever. I'm not even sure DK is real. I'd body though, for sure. Like, it's not, it's not a bug. Oh, boy. 
Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Turned around in the back room. That's fun. It did a whatever amount of damage, so I guess. It's not a it did eight. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. I think I know what he's doing, I guess. I, uh... <laughs> He did the ding dong thing. Oh my god. <laughs> um, in in Smash Four, I mean, I'm just telling you specifically. Okay. Um, in Smash Four, Donkey Kong had a really infamous combo where he would jump in the air with you, throw you up, double jump, and up air you would kill. It was a true kill confirm at like Yeah, yeah and uh, it was really, everyone hated it. It was called the ding dong, and they took it out in this game. Because the up throw down throws them higher, throws them higher. You can't combo with them right. But now they, they, there's a thing where Donkey Kong will jump and will throw you right before he lands on a platform so that he can full hop back and jump higher. Oh, yeah. And then, yeah, so he jumps higher and he can still ding dong you if there's a platform. It's hard to do, and I'm really impressed that you got it. Not still has three stops. High percent he's about to, Yeah, he's about to three stop <laughs> Jacob Donkey Kong. <laughs> this character, it just look, every, when I think of Jacob's Dark Punch, I do not think of this Oh my <laughs> god, that is holy shit. Um, that was cool. Game Let's go, one. Jacob. Um, yeah, I don't know, maybe, maybe, I'm gonna go ahead and give Zach benefit doubt and just say that Jacob's been playing Donkey Kong way more than Zach's been playing Roy. Because, <laughs> <laughs> because it's neither of their mains, so I'm just gonna just... My imaginary stats, uh, Zach's at like two hours of throwing, and Jacob's like like a hundred with DK. <laughs> See how it goes. Game two's up. Yeah. I don't know if uh, either of them will switch, but whatever. Oh, we're seeing uh, Town and City. These guys are friends. Zach also a relative new oh, there's the power Yeah, yeah. Oh, now it's going to be called Tana Dog. Okay. So Zach is rising to the challenge. Hopefully he can put up a fight this time. Um, Three, my foot is asleep. Two, I can't think about anything else. One, <laughs> I want to die. Go. All right, let's see how this goes. Grab, up throw, up air. It'll it'll connect at low percent. Right, right, right. It just doesn't kill anymore, which was what we were about. Ooh, barely missing that grab, but that's a great idea. Not a big punish. Just getting dead out of one of the Yeah, see, up throw, up air didn't even connect right there, and it killed it. Again. Oh my god, drop his shield. Oh. Nice. Oh. oh my god. Yep, that, if he doesn't mash out, he can kill. Wow, I'm surprised he didn't kill. Oh my god, he's close. Uh, that's oh my god, Jacob is just beating him at every turn. I don't know whether um, back has planned to come back, but the Palutena, yeah, what were you saying? Oh, that's the only way. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's got to rack up damage, because Palutena cannot explosively come back on you like Roy can. Um, speaking of explosions, so that, there we go. that's there the go. name of that move. Yeah, yeah, he actually started doing it when he said that. He probably hurt us, but whatever. There's not much we can do about that. Maybe we an up smash, Jacob definitely going to get punished. I think he could have gotten a bigger one, but he's a big money. I'll throw Why not throw that up air? Oh, that was, I think... It looked like Zach like accidentally spot dodged after that. I don't think he meant to just stay in there after he landed. He wasn't in land the whole time. And it, it's about to look like a repeat of game one. He's about to get double three stock. Jacob is fully confused. Oh, he's shooting. Take his stock. Oh, no. Come on, Zach. Please, there it, there it hits. Oh, it didn't kill that oh, weird angle. Oh, there it is. Jacob slow falling to the stage doing just absolutely nothing. Falling asleep on his controller. Oh, he did a back throw. What? He could have gotten that, that new, the Neo Ding Dong. The he would have. Neo Ding Dong? Yeah, he could have gotten the Neo Ding Dong if he would have just up thrown okay, it. Okay. <laughs> Zach's not going down without a fight. There it is. Without a fire. Okay, not really anything you can do off grab right now with Donkey Kong, but he's oh. close. Back into the ground. He's walking all the way through. Zach did not Dang. mash at all, so if he just Ooh. lets him go from mid stage all the way to the blast zone, that's why it's important. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> he 
He was mashing? Yeah, I Dude, can hear that, it from here. That's BS. What the fuck? That's awful. <laughs> I'm a I'm mad. That's dumb. Yeah. Yeah. They need to nerf that. That's garbage. 3.0, where are you at? Uh, they, didn't they just nerf uh, Inkling's roller? So yeah, they did. Yeah, that's what I thought. But they, I, from what I heard, they, it's a small tweak more than anything. Yeah, they just made the hitbox a little smaller, and you're not stuck in the ground for as long. Yep. That's why it's relevant, because the ground stuck thing is similar to being stuck in Donkey Kong Drive. It's a, you'd mash out to get out. All right. Wow. That was that was a dominant showing. Here comes Donkey Kong coming out of nowhere. Pocket pick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because I beat you with my the first time I ever played Ike, and I beat him. First time ever. <laughs> I think he was a little bit inebriated, but that doesn't matter. What, Paco's in the bracket? Oh. Well, has he been in the bracket this whole time? <laughs> Jacob, has Paco been in the bracket this whole time? Or okay, I was gonna say. All right. Okay. Uh, my dutiful commentary partner is off to play match. Chrono and Paco. This will be cool. Um, I haven't. Have I seen Paco play this game at all since it came out? Ooh, who does he play? Pichu Yoshi. All right. Oh no, I gotta play. It's kind of a oh, kind of said come take Paco. All right, switch now. Paco's Pichu versus Chrono Change Attack. Okay. Chrono, yeah. You're doing a hand warmer? Okay. So they're going to do a hand warmer first. Paco's Pichu and Chrono Cloud. Maybe. They, they're allowed to switch after the They're allowed to switch after the hand warmer. Yeah. So. Um, Pichu would be a pretty cool um, Yeah, I feel like it would be bad for Cloud. Yeah. It was like Pikachu was like Cloud's worst matchup in Smash 4, or one of them. And uh, um, this game, Cloud is worse, and Pichu is better than Pikachu. Oh, yeah, so. Pichu's just fucking really good. So. <laughs> He's nuts. It just depends if you know how to play him. Kind of hard. Uh, fast character, and you have to have good spacing with all the short ones. But if you get it right, you kind of just blow out the other guy's options. Yeah, I know Pichu's a nightmare for Wii Fit, so. Uh-huh. Oh, nightmare for most characters to, to deal with. Yeah, Pichu's like high tier, top tier, mm -hmm. probably. Probably top five. I don't know if he's top five. I'd be willing to debate that, but he's up there. And it, it, the game's weird where, like, top tier Stop can be, like, all of top tier yeah. in this game. When, like, Smash 4 is, like, four tiers. Yeah, there's, like, oh. like, that's just been, like, pretty over. Really yeah. All besides Bale. Bale was, like, top tier part two. Yeah. And then the actual top tier was, like, four or five tiers. One, go! They're sticking. I don't know how much uh, Pichu Chrono has played. We in a new character, basically new character. I mean, he's in, in melee, but that isn't that is saying much. And I uh, definitely need to learn this match. I can't really just rely on the next four stuff. I have to know what's going on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, with anything you can rely on Pichu catch up knowledge, but it's not going to get you, yeah. it's not going to get you to double your bad self. So. Hit box, hit box, hit box, hit box. Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, player, so uh, yeah, Paco being one of Bryce's, uh, consistently, like, top 10 best players. He's from CMU, he wasn't here all the time, and he's, like, more CMU than he is trying to but he still comes, he comes enough that he's part of Bryce, he's part of our family. And uh, he's always been like, he's been up there. It, it's very rare for him to be up there. Only people I think that would like upset him once in a while were like Apex, sometimes like Will this. I don't know. Yeah. Like the higher. Yeah. And that was only occasional. And he 
seems like it's very yeah, it, Chrono's putting up a good fight, and that back air kind of has a good hit and kill somehow. But, yeah, I can understand some moves, like, some moves killing for Pichu. They just have to give them, a, give them some kind of explanation that makes sense. Like, his forward kill, he can, maybe he's putting a buttload of actual electricity into it. Like, it's, it's solid contact. But his back air? Like, why is that strong? What about his body size or his ability makes that strong? I just like being able to connect those kind of things. Yeah, I know, I understand what you mean. There's a lot of shit like that when we didn't It's like they didn't, they didn't even acknowledge that he should be weaker in a physical sense than he should. Yeah, it just seems like he could be like faster and does damage to him every yeah. once in a while. Yeah, very That's little totally damage but yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, Chrono tried to, as we were goofing off, Chrono um, lost his lead. Or no, Chrono brought it back. I don't remember what was going on. Yeah, Chrono got, uh, got ahead because he got a limit kill. Yeah, yeah, he got ahead and then Taco was going to bring it back. He brought it back to the stock lead, or brought it back to the stock even, and uh, Chrono is actually still keeping up. He didn't lose any momentum, it looks like he just kind of lost his stock. Uh, panic up B, but it has way less lag than Smash 4. Yeah, and then Cloud's probably one of the people that can do that. Yeah, forward Smash is going to be hard to pull off. Okay, forward still. Chrono's doing a good job of, of boxing him out. He still does have to get in. He is a short character. He's fighting against a sword, so. Gotta make sure you stay so. Okay, okay. Dude, that forward still is barely missing out. Drift is. Ooh. Nice coverage. That down tilt will hit the low ledge of the timer right. Ooh, I think a dash check might have killed it there. Pichu, you should think of Pichu at 160 as any other character at 200. Now, forward tilt is going to wreck him. the Chrono right there. With, uh, this is pretty nice right there. Yeah, I like, uh, honestly, I'm just surprised to see how well Chrono's playing. Um, Chrono, is up until, I, I don't know how much he's used Cloud before, but I've only ever seen him use Belmonts and singles. He's been playing Cloud and Doubles. But I've only ever seen the Belmont in singles. We're pulling out the cloud apparently at the right time. Because, uh, you know, I haven't seen Paco play this game yet, but. He was playing pretty level headed too. You know, he was making sure to make, you know, kind of uh -huh. space it out. Like, not let the Pichu get right into you know, crazy Pichu and stuff. Like, yeah. Like, so, for, if this would have happened in Smash 4, Chrono could have seen Paco in Smash 4, there would be. Yoshi! There would be chaos in the This would not happen. So, Chrono is obviously making leaps and bounds mm -hmm. here. All right, here's the Yoshi, Yoshi we heard about. Yoshi coming up with Pope Pete. Three, Yoshi's two, mic. one, go! Yeah, yeah, a lot of people, a lot of people seem to be uh, a little underwhelmed with Yoshi. I mean, returning Yoshi players. It seems like they kind of wanted more. Um, and I can kind of agree that Yoshi's main problem weren't very fixed. I mean, Egg got a buff. And that's about it. That's li it's like that's literally. Oh, he can down beat through platforms, and that's only useful first bad player, basically. Yeah. Like, it'll almost never hit anyone who's aware of it. Um, and besides that, like, all of Yoshi's core problems that kept him right out of, the, like, the top tier area in Smash 4 are still kind of present in this game. Now. And, uh, he's, like, there's just that many more matchups in this game. It's just kind of a, it seems kind of boring to play only Yoshi. Yeah. Uh, for the whole Yoshi game. Yeah. And they just, most of them took the opportunity to get assimilated with a better metal. Uh huh. I forgot to mention that forward air is actually something that's super that was brand new too. I mean not forward air, forward tilt. That forward tilt is brand new. Uh, actually sets up pretty well for up airs and whatnot, but it doesn't act exactly the firm as the tilt. Is that the tail? Yeah, on the ground. Yeah, on the ground when he does the tail. His forward tilt and up tilt look like almost the same. Yeah. Wow, that up smash reach! A little head shake from Paco. He knows that he, he thought he was out of range for anything important right there, but I thought so too. Nice score there. Nice, uh, he caught his jump out of shield. That's kind of uh, Cloud's bread and butter covered in the air with the sword. And all that stuff. I always, I always enjoy Cloud's. Oh yeah, yeah. The crazy thing is, is they they, they kind of nerfed his range for most of the moves uh, compared to Smash 4 in this game. And he still, I think, has the longest range overall for sword. He definitely has the biggest sword. They took him a lot of tricks, visual tricks, to nerf that range. 
Okay, there. That was a forward tilt, and it connects an up air. So we're getting a little bit of grounded setup, but the main thing Yoshi lagged in Smash 4 was a fast grounded move that confirmed the kill. And, uh, I mean, up smash is about as fast as one, but it's very punishable as this. Nice, when you come. It was kind of like a same repeat of what happened to Kermo, or Paco in the first dive, where he thought he was out of range, he didn't bother air dodging or anything. But, no, no, that up smash for Yoshi, he reaches all the way up, stands up his own. Oh, Play a little bit more. That was a nice spot dive for him to punish in the fourth tilt. Forward tilt, send him up. Oh wow, that nair lasted long enough to seal the deal for Paco. Chrono opting to go for the wall wall jump instead of uh, B right away because he thought he might get that edge guard, but it didn't even matter because that wall was too low for him. <laughs> yeah. Nope, they, they didn't they didn't <laughs> need to buff him, so they just no. did, they didn't. They definitely did not. Okay, that was uh, now it's one one. Paco looked like he found a little bit of an answer with Yoshi. It looks like he's a uh, he had a better time than with Pichu. Maybe maybe our initial analysis of the Pichu. Um, yeah, these are the stage list. This is the stage list, Paco. Okay. <laughs> I'm definitely accusing Paco. Um, I don't remember what I was saying. Yeah, Cloud Pichu might not be as bad as you thought, but who knows? Maybe one match. Yeah, one match is, uh... And it, I don't think we're going to see it again, because nice. Paco... I mean, you got Pichu! Oh my goodness, he went back to Pichu! <laughs> who knows? Maybe he, maybe, he's, maybe he got the reads on him. Maybe he wants to practice and he's not taking the results seriously. It's, it's one, his possible. choice. Go. Or maybe he got a big read and he would be able to punish the Pichu. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, he might have just got a read just in general. Like, yeah. Now I, now I know. Yeah, well, he better start showing us pretty soon. <laughs> He's getting rocked right now. Oh, there we go. Not the highest percent of the combo. I think he could have extended that. Oh, he could have given him right there, but he got a little spook. Okay. Dash, okay. I wonder if that dash tag kills with Pikachu, does it? Oh, it would be. Oh, that down tilt could have been detrimental to the Colonel. That's covering his landing with the side beat. Alright, it's looking like uh, second verse finishes first. We're coming to this Pikachu matchup. Hard. Oh my goodness, that did 19%. Look at this, a down air. I know forward smashes that do exactly that amount. <laughs> Yeah, that was a that was actually kind of nice. Yeah, that's true too. <laughs> Probably his his most busted hit box nowadays since up got new. Oh, he's running away with this. And if he gets like, oh, I was gonna say, I was gonna, I was probably gonna get that too. I was gonna say if he hit him with the boost like one more time, that was that. Pichu cannot handle another boost. Nice. Yeah. Paco got the power shield up tilt and uh, he kind of he kind of floods the follow up. I think jump down B might have been the thing to do just from what I've seen of Pichu. I don't actually know. Do that forward tilt. It, Chrono tried to air dodge out, but he air dodged directly out. And which, when you air dodge, it kind of it moves you back before it moves you forward, so it, it moved him back even the last time. Yeah, I thought he was going to do Yeah, I think if he would have jumped, if he would have just spam jumped, but I didn't want to lose the jump early. And the, you know, the difference between the uh, air dodge killing and just normal dying, the following was 1%. Yeah. He's got him looking. Okay, now uh, Paco has a chance because he brought the, the stock back to even. <laughs> Fastest smash attack Cloud has. That was, that was like, sickening what he did to that mouse. I was about to predict Blakey, but I was just on it. But yeah, that's what he's been doing at 1%. Blakey does a lot of damage. Um, kind of gives you time to run after the people today. Okay. He tried to bury that bear, and he missed. He got hit, didn't tag. Side B follow up, all of a sudden he's at 12%. This is going to be a hard comeback for Paco. But... Oh my god, he just keeps hitting with the bucket. I, I'm surprised the first one did get the sweet spot. 
going for, he's, he's trying to build he's the momentum for it. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to build his momentum. Like, if he, if he makes a big read right now, gets in Chrono's head, that sets him up for glory the next time. There he goes. Look, Chrono's getting, you know, panic options. You can see him coming out. Let's see if he can keep yeah, it together or Paco's going to do that, that top player oh. shit to him. All about right here. Uh -huh. I think I think uh, oh. Chrono saw blood, so. Chrono. Is he going to do it? Ooh, Paco was going for it all. Oh. Oh. Overextension from Paco. Chrono looks like he's taking to his safety a little more. Kind of trying to up throw. Oh, he barely missed the up air. There's that nair, hit him out. Down tilt in safe. Paco's bringing his right back. He doesn't want to get hit by the blue stuff. There it is. Oh, oh he perfect yeah. shielded into a forward Ooh. smash. That God. was beautiful. That was God. Paco clutching, clutching that two stock comeback. That was very <laughs> nice. That was sick. Yeah, that was uh, awesome. That's that's what you. That's what the, the, the one mental advantage mm -hmm. you get from having experience and being keeping a top player cool at any time. point. Keeping your cool in that last set, last oh, yeah. stock is really what he, know, he knows, you know, maybe he doesn't hasn't practiced this game very much, but mm -hmm. something that'll carry over in all Smash games oh, yeah. is how to conserve momentum. Oh, yeah. That was nice. Very impressed with Paco yeah, right there. That was Pichu taking it. After that, after that uh, dominant game with Yoshi, too, mm -hmm. he made the bold choice to go back to Pichu and just... Yeah, I mean, that's, that's I'm on really, stream. Oh. That's going to play on stream. Okay, All right, we got LDS coming up on stream right now for Seth versus. Oh, okay, remember correctly. Because he's a Fox player, I believe. I recently actually just bought his Switch, so now he's been playing with a lot more characters, and he doesn't really know who he's playing. Yeah, because I know I faced off him round one, and I went 2 1, I almost beat him, but. So I don't know too much about him. I know you know him. Yeah, he so, was in my yeah, car. You know him, so. He's so very new to the competitive. So you'll be able to uh, try to some insight, but he is pleased with that, so. It'll be a hard fought battle for, for him right here. Yeah. <laughs> but he, he won his first round, I don't know if he's Oh. Alright, yeah, that was, that was that. Pretty, pretty good right there. So, being new competitive is not coming around Tri City too much. You know, it's already good. But yeah, I actually uh, I went to like some random church local and I was like, because one of my friends wanted me to go because he knew who was putting it on, and I actually met Sweet Tea there, and I was like, hey, you should be in this group chat yeah. and come to actual tournaments. He's like, that's it. Yeah. Always good to recruit some. I know he's been playing around with Falcon recently. Falcon? But I don't know if that's who he's going to pull out. Yeah, the ditto yeah. going on right I kinda, now. I, I kind of want that to happen. That's pretty sick. I think Seth's been playing Pain the Calico in the yeah. bracket. We'll see if, uh, Red I'm still imagining Falcon. Uh, 
on the, I mean, it's a standard, like, you have to dunk it. Like, you're like, like yeah, crap. Kind of going. You just go for it. You're just yeah. like, you know. And, like, that's how I play too, so I understand the mindset. But, you know, just, you're just going for it, going for it. You know, that's what you play that. Is it not necessarily, you know, necessarily, like, cut down dunk stuff. Yeah, there's there's more to it. Yeah, old experienced players are gonna definitely play every game you do. Like like you know, pretty obviously it looks happy. Let them come to let him come to him. Every time he's going towards him, throwing something out so he's set to wait. Uh, instigating a Dude, let's go. Ditto. ditto. Come on, buddy. It's what the stream wants. Good, good experience for this week. Three, two, one, go! Let's see what Seth's doing in this role and what he's getting. Oh, he's just going. And that down air into throw into down throw is pretty good. Seth is probably just going to play super easy and aggressive. Ah, that was a nice and he knew yeah, that was his red suit. Oh, he's going for He's giving that. him that info dump. I at do that the same end. problem too. I do the same thing. Best way to learn is just kick your ass kick. Yeah. I mean, playing someone 
consistently better than you is going to help tremendously because if you're always playing with people it's much worse than you, you're just going to build a bunch of bad habits and when you find someone who can exploit those habits they're just they're going to exploit it and move Coco versus Moon Splitter. Ooh, so it's going to be Alamar versus Oshiyam Kazumi. Yeah, I main the only plays here. That I haven't really seen uh, Roger Hunt. Yoshi! Hold on, buddy. Were you watching the, uh... Snap? Three, two, one, go! Yeah. <laughs> Did you take any bets on it? I want $3. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, Moon Splitter is going to play this Yoshi versus Alamar. So this is now Alamar is very much the best to watch. So I'll ball the drink or pick up the damage and then this is the first match that you get to that. Very good. Uh, Alamar can get a lot off of hitting your opponent's forehead. So once really? you're in there, you just rack up I mean, if you just rack up damage, like nothing, I'm going to be careful about it. Yeah. 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 I was close to killing him. Alright, so I'm pretty good. 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 I'm Oh yes, I believe you're up in single. Oh. Oh, uh, last time I had a very negative opinion about Alomar, but... Do you know even how good they are? Yeah, he thinks Alomar is really overrated, but... I don't know. It could, I mean, it's possible, I mean, it's still early on in the game, it could uh -huh. be the mindset of how it's played in the game, so I think it's like... I think Weapon B is a good smash. Everything seems to get more aggressive with all the Smash 4 people think it's a good Smash 4 getting more defensive. Yeah, but it's just the main one. Yeah. yeah. And I think so, the Coco is going to have a huge shock lead going on. So I want, I'll take the shot. Let me add it. I'm down. I think that a bunch of free top ones. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> They didn't put it in there. There's a three stock coming out from Coco. Dude, if they come out from Coco, I'm going to wait for this one. Yeah. Some ketamine or something like that. Seth coming back to the bag. Here's around. We got soft tacos here? Yeah, some motherfucker just dropped off. I don't know who they were. Let's go. <laughs> oh, yeah. You probably, like, move the mic so they take a bite. I don't give a fuck. You can give a fuck. You should really, you should really give a fuck. <laughs> Jacob will be livid. Aroma Black! I think 
I think they're also that's wacky and like the first time you play it, you like the other kind of kind of read what you what can happen to you. The fact that he's not that good for that is not really worth it, but it's fun to play. Sometimes that's what matters in life. I'm better than with Yoshi. Yeah. So he's already ahead. God damn it, now I'm doing it. I'm still making lips making noises in the mic. It's hard. I mean, you're not actually done. I know, it's hard not to start for a little bit. That uh, TF water right there. Makes sense. Gotta get to the TF. Oh, recovery, the fuck? Recovery. The thing is, I've never seen, I've never seen Slither recover to the He always, he just goes above this guy. 100% wonderful. I don't know what he's saying. Why? <laughs> that forward smash got clanged with? That was so weird. <laughs> Okay, I guess we'll see what Joker's up to. I think Joker's probably gonna be pretty. Yeah, I hope so. I mean, I've never, I don't know anything about Persona, but I'm gonna play the Persona games eventually. Oh yeah, probably. I think the they're next gonna have to. Play. They're gonna have to port them to Switch. I feel like at least five. Yeah. Four and five probably. They probably should. I'm finally gonna get a Switch in my own two weeks. Oh, you yeah, don't have a Switch? Practice. How do you practice? I don't. I come to here every week. Oh I practice God. here. Well, come um, Sunday. I I'm getting like one Sunday off a month. To come here. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> that came but, out of nowhere. I <laughs> him sucks. Yeah, that's why I uh, don't practice it besides I get here, so uh, I just watch videos and then hope I Wow. Well, well get a switch, stupid. Yeah, hey, I'm gonna switch when I get my taxes back. Get your taxes, stupid. Which my taxes are gonna be Go get them. Bodacious Go. now this year. So Yeah. Oh yeah, making I'm a lot of money. Fat check. I'm not a, getting one. That didn't work this year. <laughs> I'm getting a fat check because I had a kid last year. That's the main benefit. Oh yeah. Yeah. That was. Oh, I, I, I thought your kid was older than that. He's like 10 months old. So wow. He was born like March last year. Is that your first kid? Okay. Thankfully, I'm only 21. <laughs> so. <laughs> I, I, no, I, one of my best friends graduated in high school. He's he's got his third kid just like recently. Yeah, he had his first kid when he was like 17. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I have any more kids ever. Yeah, I mean, that was that was too much already. Like twenty having a kid for the first time—that's too much. Yeah, I'm conflicted. I want—I know I want. I would like. I, it would be really hard for me to to like die without ever having had a kid. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I do not. I can't imagine raising a kid. I just can't do it. There's like no way that'll I happen. Mean, kids are chill, but. Um, sure. If we don't have another match to play, then yeah. Okay, I got a plan stream then. All right, Seth is back on stream. He's against Lux, who's a K. Rule player. We get some K. Rule action going on. We get Seth and we get K. Rule. Versus Lux, aka the K Rule player. Is um, <laughs> Matsuo. Probably Kyle came in, came in. But that K 
Rule then. Oh uh, yeah, I'm sure I think by the degree you find more of it. K rule! Pretty... I don't think you really have a lot of the game. Because a lot of the advantages are like not gonna have a ton of Three, two, one, go! That was the hardest thing to come from straight out. Get out of there. Yeah, you still have a lot of auto right now. You need to get close to the next game. He baited out that that smash. Yeah. Oh, actually, I'm taking out the game one. I'm not game surprised one. by it. Yeah, that was game one. Lux one, game one. There it goes. Back to final destiny. Stop the battle! Oh, oh, Kyle Chain, I feel like it was just. I mean, I think. Necessarily say luck, but luck kind of got the first two stocks off some way. He knew that he was going to start off with Wow. 
Like, let's see what he's gonna do. Let's see, let's see what he's gonna do. Pretty hype. It's always good to watch a good upset. Everybody's watching right now. Everybody's eyes are focused for anything. Actually, up a shot in game two. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, we got Coco coming back.
Wolf and Olimar. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> yeah, yeah, I follow him. Give him a back and forth. I'm picking up wolf, I just am not ready to use A lot of people are picking him up. Good. He is so well rounded, good. He's just like, he was like, how good pre patch she felt. Well, in Smash 4. Just with more damage output and some cooler moves. Like, cooler. He's cooler, yeah. cooler and as good. So, way many people are going to play him. Ooh, that's a nice power shield. He's trying to bring something back, but uh, it's a big deficit. For bringing, to bring back against a character like Alamar? Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, big hill. Okay. Freaks off stage. Side B, not gonna take it by you. Uh, yeah. It's actually crazy hard to understand how things are going to Blue, I'm not actually not killing any kind of spell. I was pretty good. I was going to take a whole other shot. He's got two purples and a blue. There's no, <laughs> yeah. there is no harder of a lineup to be at kill percent. Two purples and a blue. <laughs> yeah. Omar wins! Alright. There's Pinko. Swept that wolf. I don't know if he went, uh, I don't know if he's been going wolf before. I mean, obviously, I don't think wolf if it loses the matchup or anything, it's the file tile characters. 
he has a, he has Meta Knight too. He's actually right. shown us he still has a Meta Knight. Oh, Chose Ox with it. Oh wow. Um, I don't know how he does Bruce Alomar in this game. I think it's pretty good in the last game because the ladder is pretty easy. Uh, this is one of Freak's most favorite stages. I think it's either just the music or the music. Stop the battle! Definitely kind of picked me here a lot. Uh, Dark Pit definitely is the most attractive thing in this game, so that's what the resort to looks like. It's, it two, seems like this matchup might one, be kind of hard with how go. much the kick man will slow down his kicks. He has so many multi hit moves, he'll just be stuck in the air. It's such a weird dynamic. And also, side B will get stuck on the kick. <laughs> doesn't seem like a big thing, but it is for free because he uses that a lot. Yeah. Oh, he just late, late as heck. <laughs> Those arrows might give him a little bit of mileage. And through the pick me. I heard a rumor, and no proof is true, but I heard you can, if you shield, you know how you can shield and hold a button and angle the shield without jumping on or anything? Yeah. If you do that with Pikmin on your shield, it'll wiggle off the Pikmin. Oh, I haven't heard you. Yeah, and Pikmin will just come out and off you. That's so cool. Okay. Wow, he's not dead. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah? Cool. I didn't know that that didn't do that. Hey, there's that side I was talking about. Gosh, that sent him far. <laughs> With the rage, too. All right. Uh, Freak is there. I don't think he gets his first up. He's in such a better position. I don't think he can get this lead. Sorry. I cut you off. Do you feel like Alamar's wet? Uh, we get the lead. I don't know why so hard, though. I think he took the first stop really. Yeah, and he got it right there with that side B. I think the pullback, like the very minimal pullback, definitely doesn't pull back as much as like the normal big side B. But it looked like Coco with the fair right as that side B started coming out. So that was super lucky for Freak. Yeah. Okay. Freak, his low percent combos are on point. I get so mad. It's, it's really it's annoying. <laughs> It's really annoying to get hit by a low percent combo because you're not in tumble the whole time, so you don't feel like you should be being combo. Like, he hits you with like three different aerials and the whole time you're just getting like head punched over stun. But you're never like flipping around yeah. in tumble with no smoke. Why am I getting hit? <laughs> but yeah, he'll, he's got, he's lagged his like 35 plus percent combo the low percent. It's scary. Nice side to Trump, save that arrow, arrow does a lot of damage too compared to the last game. I think one more useful. I don't know. Uh, I know fully charged does like nice. <laughs> fully charged is moody. <laughs> it does like seven. But uh, the, yeah, the normal one's like nine. Like uh, a little laser, I think unscaled is like eleven. Oh my god! <laughs> the extended hitbox that he rolled into. That's kind of yeah. You know, Coco, like, couldn't, you can't be super mad about that. That was just kind of dumb. Still got, and he still definitely has a chance. He got him off stage, and keeping the stock count back up right away. He kind of didn't know what to do. When Freak just held that reflection, hold it for a long time. And he chooses when to let it go, so he just, like, put that and waited. Any of the smash decks would have been reflected back at him. All right, there you go. Freak uh, lost that stock. It looks like he knows what he's doing. Um, Pikmin are going to be a big team racking up damage in the stack of the How is he going to keep him off it? Okay, we got in. Really good at reviewing your disadvantage. Okay, just throw a circle back on stage. I think now that Freak didn't know about it, he just has the third Oh, he's got the perfect to do again. It's not exactly kill percent. It's still like doable. You can definitely like kill these Pikmin if you decide to throw them half as easily. But you don't want to get to kill percent and still have fun. We're telling that people to get fun. Losing this game on that screen. I don't know what it is, but like the strat is way easier to get. It seems like most people, most of them are going to be I don't know what happened. I don't know what was happening, and they were like, they were both just in and out of shield for a second, and all of a sudden somebody died. <laughs>
Yeah, I, I saw the. I saw it was a forward smash, but it looked like you were shielding, and so was Freak. And then I don't know. All right, Paco and Jantham. Awesome. This is exciting. Hi, are you still in winners, Jacob? Did you, how did you, how was it? You're doing pretty good then. That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, it's probably doable once you super learn the matchup. You just I know. Okay. Paco, hey, uh, stream, stream overlay. Boom splitter. Boom splitter. Hey, Tex, do the stream overlay. Um, Paco and Jamie. I've said it a million times. <laughs> uh, Paco had a really exciting set earlier. He made that huge comeback on Chrono with Pichu. That was sick. That was sick. Yeah. He like a uh, parry the last Stop hit off of a limit cross slash. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's actually what he did. Oh my god, I forgot. <laughs> that, that takes some balls. The thing <laughs> is, uh, Chrono definitely ran forward after he uh -huh. cross slash. Like he could have blocked that, but it's still just crazy. Yeah. It's crazy to see. No one would expect that. Uh, I versus Pichu does, does not sound fun. Uh, it doesn't sound fun for Jansen, but it also depends on if if Paco doesn't have at, Three, at, two, at matchup experience, one, he go. could get thrown around. Scary point. Like, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, that clothesline, clothesline would have been uh, a lot more. Ooh, that would have reached the ground. But if it's worse, normals don't like rip on anyone small, he has a good chance. But uh, I, that one is perfect shield for him. That's kind of nuts. He's kind of nuts. He had a good start. Yeah, Paco is way closer to dying than he is. Yeah, but that was a good punish. And he, he did a kind of a weird weird out direction of the sky. On the ground behind me. Like, this one, I was trying to get it off. Okay. Look at this idea. Down here. Okay. Oh, oh, that was so Well, at least the trade is. You yeah. know. He'll take what he can get. Hermit shields have been on point. Hey, you know, you get the, uh, I beat him and then he did the rest of the thing so that he packed his little pocket on the Unfortunately, Pichu didn't do whatever. That's a good idea. Jantham went too hard to fall with those aerials. Nice spot dodge. That was an exceptionally hard spot dodge. Wow, 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 what did I see? <laughs> Trying to run past him, that is not worried. Whatever down smash is, it, that's kind of what it's for. <laughs> like, it's for, for those weird spammers. Yeah. High yeah. profiles and what the hell was that? <laughs> you just was, that a, was that up air? <laughs> that's up air. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think that's true. I mean, maybe you can like spam air dodge. I don't know. Maybe. No clue. And uh, up right there at the ceiling, he can't like DI up to live any longer. So he kind of <laughs> just has to... Like, <laughs> Just don't be in that situation. Yeah, yeah, just don't be there. Okay, Paco, pretty convincingly. I think he still had two stocks when he yeah, did. Yeah, so yeah. He's pretty, looking pretty good for him. I don't know uh, what, Jantham, I mean, that whole game, he didn't hit any uh, revenge or side beat turbine, so maybe with the addition of those, that would be good. He can make good adjustments. Oh, Yellow yeah. plan. Three, Paco is switching one, every game so far. Go! 
I don't know. I, uh, I, I didn't buy plants. I don't. I could download. I didn't download. I don't. I don't have to buy it. Yeah, I don't care. I don't dislike it. I like my plants. I just don't care about plants. <laughs> that good. I just, uh, yeah, no one cares. Yeah. Uh, the new character type. Like, Those high recovers will definitely get beaten out by his strongest move. He yeah. pops up and is additionally the pops up and Ray loves it. I think he comes out like frame two. That, that ball? Yeah. It's nuts. Is that ball called two? Is that a different one? One of the one of Plants moves is called two. I don't know which one. Yeah, that's ideal definitely kill. Yeah, put him in a bad position. Yeah, I know he really didn't have a chance, a choice, but the start is up to there. Oh my god, this is good thing that dash can just travel through. See, that, that reach is a crazy card. Even the spot dodge is a little bit like Oh my oh. god. Wow, okay, just taking advantage. <laughs> Two legs like, don't counterpick. Two stocks, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He held his own. No second here. We're playing serious, man. Bring back that PQ. <laughs> And if he has cookie series. Uh something kind of see how it's gonna be. Yeah, the last one. What is it? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. 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 Oh my Okay, Yoshi, no. going Yoshi. The last, the last time we saw Yoshi, only for one game, but he uh, did the best of the set versus Chrono. So, because Yoshi might be the best character in the series all time. Ooh, I saw Revenge almost come out right there for, uh, it's frame five, so it's pretty bad. It's a pretty reliable and kind of go for an island play. Tight situation, so there's no uh, almost died since. Oh my goodness. A crazy hit stun for one of these, yeah. Hey, I mean, like, one back throw of blood I don't know. Kind of like this idea of blood. Not back throw of blood. Down air almost killed blood. Oh god, that forward tilt covered. Bro, it's not bad. Jake. Paco's P or Pikachu. Paco's Yoshi looking like the uh, star MVP of the game. Rasta. So far. Nice. Up throw. Not gonna do jack shit for him. This is looking bad. This is gonna be a three star. Ooh. Down throw forward. And Up throw. Still nothing. It's not on the platform this time. Forward air. That slant kind of giving him a. Bad time. Yeah, yeah. Move out the way out there. That's it. I don't even think he had to go out there. He could have waited for the side. He could have done anything. But no, he knows he can't do jack out there. All right. Paco's Yoshi looking strong. That is uh, the set 2 1 Paco. What? Okay. It's on stream. Oh, jeez. I play every set on stream. Oh, I hit my knee.
Hater bread. Bro. <laughs> yeah, the last set, dude, fucking Seth was just throwing out his knowledge. I was like, oh yeah, that was a really good opening. <laughs> <laughs> just start saying random facts about yourself. I like cookies. <laughs> oh yeah. Bro, all the chocolate chips are really good. <laughs> Still not done. Are you playing against Sub? What was that? I didn't see him here. Ah, uh, he was definitely here. Stop Battle Corona Black! Oh, there he is. Captain Falcon! This will be an interesting cut. Show us that. Oh, uh, all that. It was the last time we saw them play. Yeah, it was actually one of them. Oh wow. Yeah. But it did show me how it works. I did my coat right there. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Yeah, that's my coat. It's in one of the pockets. Got a little bit. Angry, right? Dog Shabbos! Nothing? Three, two, one! It is not that I don't go! Oh, they're going oh, and they're going right in. Oh, 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 they're going right in. Yeah. That SD's 
Oh, he got me. That's why I have to do that. Yeah. And I know I'm gonna do stuff like that. Also, like. Oh, yeah. That's the only thing I'm gonna do. Got a good read. Stop battle. Captain Falcon. Anna. You know if this uh best three best five. 
This is best of three, I'm pretty sure, because it's semi. Uh, Chodox did, yeah. Stop the battle! Thomas! Captain Falcon! I told you. <laughs> you were right. Good thing I'm not a gambling man. <laughs> Worst. Okay. Three, two, one, go! I'm the Yeah, so if you 
Smash Bros. The real neutral stage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the stage. <laughs> They're just lying to them. Oh. Right. Yeah, I'm not gonna do a DD in my deep. Yeah. I'm sick of it. Three, two, one, go! This is, uh. Yeah. I'm not sure. I don't know. If, if I were playing that, I would have to like push up your customer. But so far, as you can just do it better. So. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I have a lot of safe stuff, so you just wait for Oh, okay, yeah. You wait for Nair and then you, like, shield in. He jumps at you, and you, like, you know, You might do that fair, but you can't really do that. You can shield it. So, Nair, Nair is not going to you, so you don't have to do necessarily. You just try to punish him. And that's what I try to do it by uh, up being on a shield. Yoshi doesn't matter really. Uh -huh. And he has a lot of, 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 he has
not, maybe not as much as you do, but he's not just gonna die to random stuff anymore. Yeah. And that super armor definitely helps. He's trying to just cover the next summer savings there. That was a great legend. Oh, that's for his man. Ooh. Oh, that's very fortunate. He still had his. <laughs> He lost his jump, but the spike was so close. Uh, really good to use it. A directional air dodge is definitely kind of a buff for Yoshi in a way. He has more options for the next stage, you know? Big jump out complaining about. <laughs> Dude, it blocks these for them. They go off, dude. This oh. game is like going off on people, dude. Yeah. Wait, you beat free class. Oh. Oh, a piece. Alright, so Norris got a lot of mileage to make up. But considering Yoshi doesn't really have any of his turns, it's very good. Yeah, for sure. That is also uh, really helpful. Also, the projectile bomb set, you know, is great. Because Yoshi can't just, like, run and shield, like, power shield it and then run it. Because you have to be and shield it. So running and shielding makes your, makes your, your projectile bomb. That's that's what buffed the Samus, but I still feel like you can do it. Right, maybe not right now, but 
No, 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 Yeah, he's, he, he wants it. Uh, thankfully, he didn't hit the sweet spot that time, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I know it's, it's annoying. I hate solo cards. I think I SD'd the game before, or maybe the first game. Okay, well, it'll, either way, Lux is taking a good percent from that. Yeah, he's kept up. That he can take a whole nother stack of here. Yeah, that's pretty strong. And Yoshi's story is one of the lower seals in the game. I think it's the lowest of the losing stage. Okay, I'd be doing just a little bit extra damage. Down one angle forward tilt. I wonder if that kills earlier than up tilt for him. How'd he get up? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> or it was a good attack. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I don't know how fast uh, the angle there is. Apparently not fast enough. Down air hole is low. Why is it so much harder to avoid than like the angle here? And he can't avoid the angle. Yeah, yeah, bro. So long as he Okay, uh, doesn't have much of a lead as previously stated. Oh, he's 
so fun. hard. They do it. Okay. All right. Green took a risk with that side B. I mean, you really want to take the stocks from a big character like that early, but uh, you gotta actually have to. Oh my. Yeah. I noticed when I played him too. Lux isn't going to really air dodge without thinking about it first. And so if you do a quick combo, that kind of makes up a guy or get him with a sweet spot in the ledge. But he didn't die, and now he's back on stage, ranking that up. Yeah, I knew he was going for it. He didn't fast fall though, he probably would have died if he did. <laughs> nice! Wow, what the hell? Freak fell down on it. That's unfortunate. Nuts. Okay, he has is no fear. I don't know what it is. It's hard for me to understand what it could be good about K. Rule. Nuts doesn't. Oh my god, he threw back to He can stage like me. God, I'm positive. I can. I like. I'm just. I, I'm gonna practice that. I'm gonna land that. I know I tech. Suck on the one. Wow. What? What? Okay. Recovery. Yeah, that up Hello? It killed him at like 140 on his first time. What did he, what did he, what's the game yeah. from that? What, yeah, he must have learned something. <laughs> wow, Arrow finally taking out at like 200 and infinity percent. Yeah. Now he's got a final confirm, which is really good at avoiding you. Okay, we has not gotten sucked up since that, that last, well, I guess. Oh my goodness, holy shit, that could have been bad. So weird they get Big Body really long recovery. Oh my god. That was a clash of the Titans. That was nuts. They okay. did like 12%. Do it again. Oh my god. <laughs> he fell backwards. He fell backwards. That was so funny. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's push that one out. Um, Freak having a apparently unfortunate SD. I didn't say it, but... Now it's 1 1. Let's keep, let's keep his momentum going. Hopefully, not SD himself, as seems to be the theme today. The really will trade in SD. I think, like, Chose Doctor SD twice when I said ISD once. It's just bad today. Bad out here. Cold weather is pretty troubling. Yeah. Cold. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that was. I don't know what that is. You don't have a game you can kind of hit from so. Probably a banger. Yeah. I'm going to assume. Hitting. <laughs> Three, two, one. We're going to see a side piece of K. Rool. Hot take. I knew it. We might see another side B. Or not. Well, um, I said or not, so it doesn't that down air, if you don't get the sweet spot, we'll still combo this up. Nice. Alright, Freak's got his combos. He's taking, the He's taking advantage of the, uh, the nervous mental state. I assume what's head. But anybody would have. Yeah, Freak's really gonna get your head. He's a mental player by a long time. Uh, for a second, I thought K. Rool might get hit by his own hand. <laughs> I don't know if that is possible. Here. Rack up the save damage. You gotta get really important to take the stack. When you collect, I was going to get but he was going shield by luck. Oh no, he has a crown. What will he ever do? <laughs> wow, I can't believe I can grab this. 10 airs. Uh, the pickup can be canceled anything. It's like, because you don't press A, you can run over you. If he's on the ground, he's like straight back to the ground. Oh, fuck, he's back here. He does a lot of damage in the summer spot. He puts him in a bad position. Lux is one of the best players I've seen in tri-city skill levels, essentially, that will, that will hold the ledge in. Consider his option. Fucking cool. <laughs> he it is really cool. I like watching him. He's not having very often pressing. Tries to get the in bed on and off stage at the left. Okay, I gotta find some way to confirm this kill on Freak. It's hard. Uh, Freak definitely has way safer options for poking than, uh, 
Charge, charge. Yeah, that was the one thing. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> but, it took some time to think. He's studying yeah. the set while he's playing, while he's charging. Okay, okay. okay. How is he going to Oh, maybe get that gift with the suck thing. I don't know. I don't know if he's going to do it. It's a, what the fuck? Oh, what? <laughs> he's out. He knows it. He knows it. Just give up. Four there. Doing some for a set. Wow, I'm surprised that that next four there didn't hit. He is at he is at a good lead from away from death. He's really gotta play this thing. Next four there. Down wide. Oh my god, I thought he died. Yep, yep, oh, yep. Oh, oh, that's the hot. Tipper, the tipper must be weaker or something. All right, you got this. What are you going to do? He gets to stack off now. And, uh, he's scary. He's going to die from his own crown. <laughs> okay, okay. Shit, come on. I want to see something. I want to see something cool from Lux. There's that down throw. Up tilt. God damn, why did that get so close? Is it fall no? Is it going to be? Oh. He got a shot! He wanted it. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god, really? She's still going for that? <laughs> okay. Nice air dodge up. Not to get hit by the air. The air would have killed. Okay. Yeah, that'll like... I think that might have poked his shield. Because uh, it starts... To, he's so tall that it starts to expose his shield. Nice try. Wow, he put up a good fight though. Lux did great today. Took a, took a game off the top two players here. <laughs> yeah. I will never do. <laughs> yeah. Here. Sounds like a lot. Please don't ever meet my kids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I one time accidentally took a caffeine pill for like a headache or something. I, I thought it was, I don't know, I thought it was a headville or not. I was, I was dead. <laughs> what is it wrong with you? Yeah, don't. I don't, I don't care how much you can tolerate. That just can't be good for something in your body. Liver, <laughs> brain, you name it. Something is fucking up. You just don't know it. <laughs> yeah. God, dude. I have, like, I, I'm very exceptional days of, like, four hours of sleep. Like, I couldn't, have, I couldn't fall asleep no matter what. I'd get a spike for class and be like, man. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Three, Dark Pit and Samus. Freaking Chozax. 
Um, I think, I don't know when was the last time they played. What the fuck? What? <laughs> he just like armored through that. What was that? He didn't get hit by that down there, but he did though. Okay. Well, I, uh, I don't remember. I wanted to set Freak took off Joe's Ox one from midnight, but I don't know if it was the last one. I think, I'm pretty, from what I know about Freak, I think he just doesn't want to play the game, you know, if he doesn't have to. Yeah, that's what he says. I personally just think he's probably just like, that's between me and him. Wow, falling out of sand is up there, what a, what a bastard, I hate that move. Wow. Those actually just charge shot away. Or uh, Lampy down there. I think Jozox has been using our weakness kind of to like lab his offensive options because everyone knows his defense is by far as strong as Sue. And I think what he's doing is trying his best to like learn learn how to overcome when he loses the lead type of deal or like somebody's beating out his defense. You know, he needs to explore his other options. I think he knows that. Uh -huh. Wow, these arrows. Oh, oh, if that third one would have hit, it might have led me to something. Back here. I don't even know if it was a sweet spot, but it was good enough. I hate that rocket. That rocket actually staying still before it launches is actually a huge bug. Oh, nice perfect shield, but he went for an aerial, and Samus is kind of delaying on the ground after that. He could have, he, like, I kept perfect shielding and then turn around the ice grab when he back aired my shield. And that worked really well for me. It looked like a true punish, so. Nice freak nose to go real low. Hit him in the bag almost anywhere. Whoa, I didn't see. I thought the bomb ex interrupted that, so I really didn't expect to see him on the start. <laughs> nice accidental flip school. Well, that's what Freak needed. Now he has the chance to bring up the damage. Wow, Chozak's just eating those. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. That nair was, that was, it was stupid. It only did 4% because it only hit with the last hit. That's that? All right. We can go down to the Gimpin right there, I'm surprised. I would have like fast fall in there to try to get him. Wild. Okay, um, I was distracted. Uh, let's vote. I don't care. Tri-City 2. <laughs> Maybe if they, are they still uh, serving wings at midnight? Like, hey, it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> Tomorrow's Tri-City is hard. Like, I'm going to be at Smashfield tomorrow. I'm going to make it, I'm going to try to make everyone go. We're going to leave the B-Dub the tournament is at and go to Hooters. I need that money. Yeah. That was a good idea by Chosen. Like, just shoot, check in and make sure as long, if he doesn't do anything else but reflect, then they're, then they're both safe. But if he tries to like, jump out of it or something, then he would have got hit. And I, uh, I don't remember who started out with the lead. But Chosen has been keeping this lead the whole time. I feel like it. I feel I think he's been kind of commanding this lead. Uh, FD. Notoriously in Smash 4, good for zoners. I don't think enough will change to where that really isn't the case anymore in this game. So, I mean, I think most stages are good for Samus in this game. But kind of hard to pick and choose. I did have a lot of trouble with him on Battlefield the uh, last time I played him. So, who knows? Two stuff. So mm -hmm. with Battlefield, yeah, that is true. It is really hard. It is really hard. If you can't jump in on her, which is like covering really easily the run-in option, so you kind of gotta, you kind of gotta jump eventually. Get some good perfect shield, like Bader when you're running in. But if she like always has the, the neutral advantage. Really 
the Soul Soul, Soul Galia Lu, the only one that I that I know. That's the only song I would pick on purpose. Oh, 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 the rest are great. That one stands out. All right, free stick with the Dark Pit. Picking a new stage, hoping to see results. I understand. And this this is a decent one because like the stages, go. the platforms are kind of far apart. There's only two of them. Um, you can use them pretty much as much as Samus can. I don't know. I, I love PS2 for every reason. It's, it's definitely my favorite stage in this game. I was so I was as excited for it as as I do like it. <laughs> I knew this stage would be awesome. Two, plat two just moderately separated platforms. Yeah, so the problem is it's a little longer than I do, but the zoners get a weird, a weird little advantage because of how big the stage is, but whatever. How it works for me when I put all things. Work with it. I, oh shit, he rolled off with that, with that down B. They, they buffed that down B in some way. I don't know what exactly they did. I don't know if they buffed the distance it goes or something. They buffed something to do with the movement and the down B. Yeah. But I did, I did beat Chozax on the stage and stuff, so it's like doable. It's not a huge deal for the big stage. It's just something that's in the bag of your mind. Okay, it's even stocked right now, but Freak doesn't have the percent of the You don't want to let build that up as soon as possible. The moment you let, you let Chozax come back and charge into that. Uh, the moment you got to get hit. Air did not do very much damage right there. That did like 8% with all the hits. That was weird. Oh my god, he's going for it again. I saw Freak jump in his chair. <laughs> Order dash day, that's the thing. Nice, nice. Bring it back. Tra trapping chose us at the ledge seems to be the ideal situation. And just for a second, he's pretty much. You want him at the ledge. You want to be close to him. You don't want him to be at the ledge and you to be in the middle of the stage. That's that's like the worst. Then this is disadvantage for her only identifiable weakness that I can turn on. Or anyway. they're not gonna kill, but man, freaking been controlling this stock. Not gonna not gonna risk it. He definitely wants to keep the stock if he can. Playing very serious. Try hard freak right here. Not much you can do. Fourth throw would do the most damage, but he doesn't want to scale it because it could kill earlier or later. So, ooh, he down smashed. Okay. Playing it safe. Dash tag. He comes out like frame negative one. That doesn't make any sense. I see some done understand it. Um, so now he has the first lead. He's had this whole set. He hasn't taken any damage. Well, never mind. No. <laughs> Oh, we got hit by the sour spot of down air. Pretty kind of sighing after that. <laughs> Definitely, like, it's kind of depressing when you think you had, you had all the options covered to take you with something just like, that it isn't supposed to work. You're like, come on. But he didn't die, and then he ended up dying. Eventually. Oh, no. Wow. That freak hit is like, everyone understands. <laughs> It's, this advantage is probably worse for Samus than any other character in the game. You can't, I don't get, you can't approach her, especially like when you are in tumble with no double jump. It's just impossible. You can't get back on stage. You can't jump back onto her. Man, these guys both, they take the momentum and they, they hold on for dear life. They, you cannot. And not get back in with these guys. Yeah. Nice staying shield right there. Jumping God knows what against Ben Park. Ooh, Chozak thought he had a lot more time than he thought. Fucking shit. No, no, he's alive. So fucking cheap. Is what he said. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is nuts. That up tilt is so many idiots. Okay. I thought so. I'm on stream. Good luck.
podcast. It's the Flint commentary now. <laughs> it's gonna be the worst commentary of all day. <laughs>
That's definitely hard to get through. Yeah. So I feel like it's definitely gonna be a uh, really good momentum up. right here. Whoever can get that first, first, you know, mm -hmm. and really uh, pace of you. Definitely. Like again, these players like they're so good at playing the turtle like the turtle yeah. style. Coco's just so good at like, can, like he'll get one hit and then he's like, oh, I think 40%. <laughs> yep, and that's, that's just kind of how all my rolls. It's rough. Yeah. Don't get out. Get more That's a good spot to touch. I probably didn't go somewhere that. I bet uh, the, like, the projectile and Pikmin interaction is really weird. Yeah. Just throw the Pikmin at his charge shot, you know, just kill the Pikmin. Take Pizza's charge shot, not a, not a good look. What a dangerous lineup you've got here. Man. Blue's gonna seal it. Blue Pikmin, very strong. Always, always seems to pop him at the right time, too. Yeah, Coco's making conscious decisions about that. He's uh, in both Smash 4 and Ultimate. It's not random, so. Yeah. Oh, I've never seen him. Trying to run away with that. We'll see if Shogak can get some magic happening real quick. Definitely, uh, in, he could definitely make it back. He's a player that could. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I've seen, seen him make comebacks before, uh -huh. but. It's, just, Al it's Al hard. Al yeah, Alomar is a hard character to kind of scrap with when you die. Yeah, 
cover and hide and avoid that bear there. Oh wow, yes. reads the spot dodge gets the up smash there. Yeah. What is this? Uh, this is... Uh, this is gonna be hard to come back from, but I wonder if after this game we can see a character switch and go yeah, back to Samus. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that he thought it was gonna go better than it was here, yeah. but he might just have more confidence with the Samus, so we could just uh -huh. switch back after this is over. Not really getting too many uh, edge guards. Mm -hmm. Lucina is definitely good at and huge if he could land those, but he just hasn't gotten them. Oh, yeah. That's going to be the game. The JV3 coming from Coco there. City here. We'll see if Chozak decides to stay on the scene or bring something new out this time. Thank you. Might feel a little shook after that first game, but you know, you know, you'd never see it on his face. Obviously, he's stone cold. Yeah. You know, there's a lot going through that brain. Yes, right? definitely. Oh wow! Whoa. Seeing the wolf come right. out. Okay. A lot of people have been picking up a wolf. Kinda, kind of. Everyone's yeah. got a pocket wolf yep. nowadays. <laughs> one, two, one, go! Definitely could get a lot of mileage off that laser. Pretty, uh, going pretty aggressive, actually. Yeah, I didn't. I expected it to be more of like a more of a laser fest this game, just trying to contest with the Pikmin and stuff, but. Got a lot of damage on him already. Yeah, like it's just one of those things. Trying to go in against Gary like Olimar and somebody who's like good with him, uh -huh. it's like it's like tough to get in. And once you get in, sometimes you just get smacked around a little bit. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Side so beyond the stage. Don't think that's what he wanted. Assuming Kozo has a lot of experience in the wolf matchup just because of how many wolves there are, like in general. Yeah, everyone is, is be playing a wolf in a bracket. Doing, yeah, doing pretty well right now. You can see the lasers coming out, trying to keep him out a little bit. Going for grab, maybe he has the beam set up. Oh, he gets it with the back air. Down to oh, down to up smash off there. Oh, that was 40% string right From there. Zero, yeah. Is that true? Um, from maybe? zero, maybe? Uh -oh. Could be. Maybe that first hit, but I don't know about the up air. Right. But it might have been. Up there is through the stage. Oh, we've got two purples in the deck. That's, uh... He's loaded. At kill percent, too, so... Oh wow, oh, got that there back over. That's Excellent good. Edgar coming from Toe's box. Still playing from behind. Oh, and that blue got attached to the oh, back. Yeah. He uh, didn't quite get it off on the time. Kind of seeing more of what he's talking about. Just kind of goes like trying to get in there, close the space, in, but Coco showing he's got a really good defense mm -hmm. too. Who do you think is best to three or best of five? I believe it's best of three today. Oh, Coming out there. 
Bear definitely one of Wolf's better. Yeah, if he lands that off stage, it's all of our yeah. is dead. Very strong. It's always fun watching like good players move. But it's like, oh, I wish I could. <laughs> oh, almost gets the down smash there. Oh, oh wow, that was that nasty. Okay. He got back on the stage. Can just box them out. Yeah, you go at the two purples. All it's gonna take is a good bear, bear at the ledge, and it'll be set. Secondaries were putting in some work, but it was hard to get through those Pikmin. Definitely, I think definitely Wolf did better than Lucina. I feel, but that's just—it's tough trying to play against a character who's good and then just like really good at the character they play as well. Uh huh. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, so run back. Yep. Okay. <laughs> so like three days. Yeah. Sight, just good. <laughs> All right. Okay, they changed it again. We're doing best of five today. <laughs> get ready. Let's see if Coco can make the necessary adjustments here. Enough strong here, but SF does do a good job of getting out of it. Mm -hmm. And when he does, he definitely makes a count. Good uh, anti air right there on the until. Oh, wow, that was really deep, but it's like, uh, just working out for him. I mean, obviously, we're not going to have a hit. Very good for smash. Yeah. Way too a lot of damage there. <laughs> yeah, that purple and the blue, that's <laughs> all, all optimal oh, kill God. setup right there. Coco's up on the entire stock right now. Oh wow, I, I moved off for two seconds and I'm just yeah. so far. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> it's all good. I'm an excellent commentator. I'm learning too. <laughs> I've just seen all the, all the projectiles come out. Definitely smart, it's like, just, if they land, they're safe, if they don't land, they're still okay. Trying to close this gap a little bit now that he's down the spot. A lot of pressure with that explosive flame. Oh. What? Harry oh. destroys that <laughs> purple pick, make it right. Oh, almost catching with that uh, up smash there. A lot of pressure on when he's at the ledge, getting a lot of miles off for sure. That's yep. kills, yep. the explosive flame. Oh, 
Jeff doing a great job right now playing from behind. Closing out game one. Alright, going to Penis 2 here. I'm assuming Seth's gonna stick with Altana. Also, too. Definitely, it was doing good that whole game. It just. He's working from behind to start. Definitely. Like, this is definitely one of those matchups where the first half determines who's in the driver's seat for most of them. I mean, I guess that's true for, like, every game, right? But I feel like it's even more so. Yeah, it's definitely this match matchup. Up. So fast with the drawback areas. Get that Dude. white Dude, off him and it got a lot of damage come to that. Definitely with a auto reticle and explosive flame. But oh, oh, got the center stage back. Yeah, so that's just kind of getting your faces, man. I feel like last game played more of a more of a defensive style kind of matched the uh, all around there, but this game he's just all dollop in there. See that in there. Go. Alatino's favorite oh, yeah. right there. <laughs> Swiss Army knife. Swiss Army player. <laughs> no. <laughs> After taking it there. The ability that Seth has is to go in, always play defensive, and kind of every game I see him play, he's always kind of in control. Even if he's not uh, in the lead, if you right. saw him last game, like even though Coco had the lead, it felt like he was still trying to approach. Mm -hmm. Where Seth was just sitting back when he wanted to. He's very, very smart dude. Got that knowledge. Doing an excellent job facing off the Pikmin right there with the short hops, you know. Palutena has that really, really good aerial drift, so kind of weaving around him is. See that bear pulling out the clock again. <laughs> trying to read his whole yeah. soul right there. He was expecting a jump off, but he said he got a nair. <laughs> oh wow, that shield's getting mighty small, mighty fast. Oh, wait for the roll, very smart. See the up air coming out here. Oh, oh what? That was at like that was 65%, tight. I believe. Yeah. All of them oh. are not the lightest dude, but yeah. Yeah, that was that was pretty nasty. Mix of him being a little light and that up air just, just being fucking good. Just <laughs> dirty. In the best way. <laughs> both harm and hurt Peladane in this matchup. So much 
especially with the short hops there. Getting the Nair. It's so fun to watch because both these players are players that kind of just like turn on the turn like turn on the back. Like, like oh, they're blocking each other out of the Oh, okay. Brain. <laughs> That was a really good reflector. Oh, in there. Again. Seth, oh, excellent yeah, off stage. That back air, not quite. Almost. We're seeing another man. Oh. If you got that, it was actually sick. But, <laughs> you know. Get the down throw. Waiting to see what the, the option is. From it, but. Oh. Did get that stage going? Did lose that forward tilt right there that closed it out. Unpick man. Oh, that's good. Got that down They're bad. The Nair. It's so fast. Oh, we see the bear coming out. Ooh, okay. Close the thing coming out. Excellent spot dodge. Because that purple definitely would have uh, would have done its job. Oh, an explosive flame killing. Take it back from downtown. <laughs> definitely. Seth's doing a really good job this game. Oh, 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 there we go. Closing out the test first off. Uh, is that just a back cancel? Or is he just like a monster? Okay. Right. I was like, oh, wow. Oh, oh, that down. That, that oh, wow. Wait, quite close it out. Good DI. <laughs> oh. That's not going to go all the way across the stage. Oh, that explosive went well, yeah. Well, this is a monster. He just does it. Pelotana, easy. Free. Yeah, easy All money. day. <laughs> nice. Hell good. I'm trying to learn names. Oh, dude. Got a question? Yeah, I got a question. 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 I Going to Smash Bro. You getting sleepy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stages. He took him to Yoshi's story last game and went to the Smash Bowl. Yep, that's true. I don't know if it's uh, just in general that's what all my wants to go to or if it's more of a matchup thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, the red box there. <laughs> Actually, setting up a nice dash attack there. Oh, oh no. <laughs> he went for it. Stock. He really don't do focus dodge. 
Oh wow, oh, but that down smash is strong out. Down smash is strong as. Human air, ooh, the big bear, okay. Ooh, you see the counter coming out there. Good stuff. Quite a bit, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh. Yeah, I ran through that. Yeah, pad. punching that pigment right <laughs> in the face. Oh, 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 that was smash. That was a great up smash. Still doing a great job to space around pigment. Got to really watch out for the first one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, that's that's unfortunate. <laughs> what was funny too? Stocks don't exist I like, I like unless you're guy. like SoCal, <laughs> SoCal melee player. So, so, <laughs> SoCal, you know they got they got that they got that code of conduct. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. It bounces up out that way. Shut up! <laughs> Alright, you game five here. Job of finding uh, any approaches stuff that they want. Uh, there. Those nares, they loot so much. You just get them all day. Golden thing. Those are funny, you only gotta keep them off the ledge as well. Like set up for um, other punch ledge guards. Like, they're really good at cutting off options, it forces them to do something. Sends at a really good angle too. Oh yeah, and the knockback growth I've heard is really good on it too. Palutena is blessed in this game. <laughs> I'm sorry. Will be <laughs> oh, this is Coco has the blue set up here, so he will definitely be looking for Oh yeah, yeah. there it is. The blue purple setups is scary only at high percent. Like, to be up there. Oh, I'm trying so hard. <laughs> yeah, that white just wasn't coming off there. Okay, close to Oh, what? I don't really good at just kind of like keeping them off as well. Like, drop to it for a second. Gonna eat a little bit there. Coco at the Oh, yeah. Really good at tilt. It with the four tilt. Coco closes out that stock. Really, anybody's game at this point. Oh, 
Well, if Goku does win this, he's got a whole other set to go. Mm -hmm. Get down there, and then there. Go oh, follow up after that. I'm trying to put the heels on him real quick. We got a back air. So that can't go into the open. This is good. good. Get you with this close point. Oh, oh wow. Up Almost. Oh, oh, the down air. That's excellent. gonna seal it. That was nasty. Good job to set Let's go there. Serve. Coco, monster. <laughs> <laughs> Trash. Wow, he just won. What trash. Yeah. <laughs> All right, hey, so signing off. Right, yeah, sign off. Come to Tri-City, motherfuckers. <laughs>